seriously. It's, this is crazy. So um, what I want to show you is our coverage on our new concealer and our new liquid to powder foundation for Unique. It's incredible. So um, there's a reason that I am what would appear to be barefaced, but have this super bright pink perky lip liner filled in on my lips. And you'll see that in just a second. Um, so I'm going to start out by using our Glorious Primer. If you haven't tried Glorious Primer yet, you are missing out on one of the most universally luxurious, amazing products that I've ever found in my life. I used to use Laura Mercier primer, not knocking it, love it. I get this for a discount because I'm a presenter and it is the best primer I've ever used. It is sincerely the softest, silkiest, most luxurious feel. It's clear, it's depositing no color onto your face, so it's not gonna interfere with your foundation coverage. Um, and it just feels so good. It smooths everything out and your makeup doesn't go anywhere. Tiny bit goes a long way, less than a pea for your whole face, okay? And you can do your eyelids, you can do um, just your face, it's, it's your, your call. All right, then what I'm gonna do is come in with our Skin Perfecting Concealer. This is, um, so Unique has a couple options for concealer. They have a mineral powder concealer, but they also just came out with this. I am literally gonna take on my hand less than a grain of rice, okay? And this is gonna be all that I need. I have a concealer brush, and I'm just gonna come into that concealer. And for this video right now, I'm just gonna do half of my face. All right, this stuff spreads so great. It's amazing. All right, it covers every dark patch, every red blotch, every blemish. Okay, check that out. Amazing. Any redness around the nose? I get redness on top of my nose too. Awesome. Any little breakouts, which my chin is classic for that. Okay, and you can see, amazing, right? It will even go right over this lip liner. I'm gonna put a touch of it there and then I'm gonna finish that off with foundation. Now I'm gonna come in with our foundation and a powder puff brush. Now I thought that this seemed a little weird when I first saw presenters doing this because I am not one to take a big fluffy brush like this and put liquid on it. Like this just seemed counterintuitive to me. But let me tell you right now, I'm addicted to this method and have been doing it every single day. So I'm gonna take my, my liquid, I'm gonna get some in here. I'm going to just put like four drops of it onto this brush. And then what I'm gonna do first is place that where I want it. Okay, then using a kind of downward swirling motion, I'm gonna buff this on. For my concealer, I used the color Velour. And for my foundation, I'm using the color Taffeta. I'm just gonna pop in with the tiniest. Okay, I wanted you to see how this went back to being an absolutely nude lip. That was with just a tiny bit of concealer and some foundation. It probably would do it at, at, most definitely here on this side. Let's do it with some just the foundation on this bottom part. So you really didn't even need the concealer. I can bring it. I wanted to show you that because I didn't have any blaringly red. Luckily for like one of the first times in my life, I had nothing blaringly red on my face to show you how great that coverage is. Now, here's what's so cool. This brush, totally dry. Totally dry. Um, I could take this brush now, keep buffing a little bit because now it's dried to a powder finish. 
gorgeous. I can even come in with some of my pressed powder and set this all up. Yeah, I'm dipping this brush right in here and I'm not even scared because it's not wet. It's not. I'm not ruining my makeup. I'm not ruining my brushes. This foundation is truly, it's like, it's liquid powder. I haven't worn liquid foundation in over 10 years. When I discovered mineral powder foundation, it changed my life because I had horrible, horrible cystic acne, um, hormonal breakouts that were um, so painful that sometimes I had to get shots of cortisone shot right into the blemishes, um, which led to horrible scarring. I had to have things lanced with scalpels. Um, it was real bad. And mineral makeup in conjunction with um, changing the hormones in um, some of my medicines really, really changed the game for me to where now I have a much more manageable skin. Um, but liquid foundation just has never done well with my pores, helping me with breakouts. I've never liked the feel of it. I feel like it's a mask. I, since I have purchased this foundation, I have been wearing it every day. Every day. I honestly, I only bought the one shade at first because I was like, I'm totally going to still sell my customers the powder compacts. I don't really like liquid foundation. Unique again, freaking proved me wrong. I, I can't even believe it. it. It's incredible. I literally have been wearing this every single day, every day since I bought it. Um, and I don't say that lightly. You know, I'm not trying to become the world's best salesperson. I could care less. I'm trying to share with you that if you like makeup, if you have an insecurity about something on your face, because believe me, I just told you some of the horror stories that I've been through. I've totally been there. This product 